Stars, it's Rox. I am coming to you today with uh, the review for Basketball Wives Season 6, Episode 14. So let's get to it, shall we? All right, you guys. I just watched the shit this morning, okay? I, after loving hip-hop, I was like, I can't take no more tonight. I'm so glad Basketball Wives, the next week is the finale. Shawnee and Evelyn sit down. They're talking about the women's empowerment movement uh, event Shawnee is going to have. I guess that's the running theme on VH1 now, child. Jackie going to be there. Evelyn ain't feeling it. But Shawnee tells her it's going to be okay because we're going to be at separate tables and it should be fine. Like as if tables is enough uh, boundaries and blockages for motherfuckers that not get over to each other. I mean, fuck, Evelyn is good at jumping over tables. So what the hell a table supposed to do? I looked at Shawnee. I said, Shawnee, bitch, you know you be trying it. So Evelyn says, okay. Then Shawnee says, you know what? I feel good. You know, the Miami crew is back together. I said, no, they're not because where's Susie at? Y'all ain't brought Susie back. <laughs> she says that she want to go back to Miami, you know, and have a good time. And it did take a little bit of convincing, though, because Evelyn says she ain't been there since Chad. Five years. But, you know, shit happened. Okay, good things came out of it. She had her baby. She met her fiance and uh okay so it's time to you know face her fears and go on back to miami yeah you know what i think i'm in okay i'm more in than out shawnee does mention to her that takari has her book coming out where did that come from i think i missed how that you know the leeway the lead in to takari's book but um you know evelyn was like really i hope that is a new york times bestseller Later on, we see Malaysia, you know, she gets Jennifer and Jackie together, and Jennifer ain't really sure how Jackie gonna be. Jackie gets there, and, uh, you know, last that she heard, Jennifer and Evelyn aren't friends anymore, so, you know, she kind of feels like maybe she can have some kind of a uh, refuge in Jennifer, but Jennifer tells her that they let bygones be bygones, and that they friends now. Oh, you guys friends like Ace Boone Coons? No, you know, we just trying to work it out, but we all right now, you know. Je um, Jackie was just like, oh. You know, I wasn't expecting that. But I got a problem with Evelyn. And, you know, I don't know what the fuck is wrong with her. She keep getting into my family. You know, I think she want to fuck my child. Jackie make it so hard for you to try to be on her fucking side. Now, how, how she jump from Evelyn is obsessed with her family. I don't think Evelyn is obsessed with her family. But Evelyn had a bone to pick with Jackie. A lot of people don't want to admit that because nobody likes Jackie. Jackie ain't my favorite person either. But Evelyn was pressing on Jackie, okay? Now, I don't think that Evelyn wants to fuck her child. What is wrong with Jackie? I'm telling you that bitch make it hard for you. You look crazy trying to defend Jackie's dumb ass. <laughs> Shit. Jennifer was just like, oh. Yeah, I don't, I mean, fuck your baby, really? Jackie's sitting there with a turtleneck on at the beach. Okay, it's sunny, it's hot. You know, Jennifer just don't know what to make of Jack. She's this bitch crazy. We jump from that to Reggie and uh, Tammy. And Tammy just finally had to break it to him. Look, I'm too fucking old to be having a baby. Okay, so what you can do is freeze up your sperm. Maybe you can have one later. He was just like, what? Am I really trying to have no baby later? Well, that's what you asking her to do. Okay, because Tammy is closer to 50 than 40. And uh, you want her to have a baby. So now you kind of know how it feels. But um, they still trying to figure out, listen, Tammy... Is I know that people going to be like always telling me you can have a baby at, you know, 50 and all of that. I'm not saying that it is impossible, but I think that Tammy's body has let her know that it ain't going to happen for her. Nobody wants to keep going through miscarriages and all of that, child. We done been through this so many times. Ain't no, ain't no sense in going over it again. Um, but as of now, I think Tammy has given up her baby making shoes. Evelyn. She says that uh, if she's going to be at this uh, event with um, Jackie, she got to protect herself. So she goes and she buys a stun gun. All right, Jennifer meets her there. And, you know, while Evelyn is telling her how, you know, she got the stun gun specifically for Jackie's crazy ass. Jennifer goes on and tells her how Jackie told her that, you know, she thinks that uh, Evelyn wants to fuck her child. And you know, Evelyn was like, what? I want to fuck her child? I know one thing, that bitch better stay the fuck away from me. She is a disgusting ass human being. I think the connections of Jackie's head, child, they just don't they just don't go to the right location. Now the women's empowerment event is today. Shawnee is praying that it all goes well. I said, bitch, I bet you are. 
the place is beautiful and she's hoping that that is enough to keep the fool of fucking niggatry ratchet ass ghetto ass bitches from fighting at her event the usual suspects are there okay everybody shows up evelyn tammy jennifer hazel jackie and jackie comes now this is the daytime it's like a brunch looking like a brunch type event Jackie shows up in all black, you know, with her Kumo D hat on, looking like she there for battle. But Jackie always, always wears all black. So, you know, they was just like, what is going on with Jackie? You got one table, it got Tammy, Jennifer, Evelyn, and Shawnee. And then you got this other table with um, Jackie. I think Hazel was sitting over there with her. There's all this tension in the room because... You know, neither Evelyn or Jackie can concentrate. They are both anxious with the other person's just their presence alone. Their backs are to each other. But, you know, you can tell that they, you know, everybody keep looking over their shoulder and wanting to fight. And I said, sure. Shawnee gets on the mic and says, let's have a good time, okay? And Tammy takes it upon herself to try to break the ice. Well, we going to Miami. Let's invite Jackie. Fuck, Jackie and uh, Malaysia are also part of the, um, you know, the OGs, even though Shawnee doesn't see that. Okay, OG of what? OG of basketball? Why is LA? Quit trying to act like it wasn't a Miami and a LA. Just because you guys took the damn Indian City off doesn't mean that we don't remember that there was an LA and a Miami. Okay, but whatever. Tammy was just like, let's have Jackie come. You, we already know that's a fucking bad idea. You know, Evelyn is kind of mad that Tammy is even trying to bring this up. Okay, are you really trying to broker a friendship deal um, at this thing? All right, that bitch better not come near me. So then Tammy gets up and goes over to the table and she tells Jackie, I want you to come to Miami. And, you know, Jackie gets all emotional, okay, and that she's mad, okay, and that Evelyn is a snake and that she wants to go over there and she wants to kill her. She's starting to cry and Shawnee sees this from across the room. She comes over, she's like, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait, that's not tears, is it? And, you know, uh, Tammy was, I mean, um, Jackie was just like, it's happy tears. Shawnee was just like, what's the matter? Like, it's okay, like, it's going to be all right. Let's just make this about the event, nothing else. And Jackie says that because Shawnee is such a good friend of her, you know, that she is going to try to contain herself and make sure that this is nice and that she don't cut up okay but you better get keep that fucking evelyn away from me all right that jackie is like a damn bomb that needs to be, she is oh she is crazy <laughs> So then, this was the fucked up ass part, if you ask me. They get up there on the stage, the panel, okay? And there's a couple of women, you know, they have their businesses, whatever. They're up there. And then they also have Evelyn up there and Tammy up there, okay? And, then, you know, Shawnee is asking the panel different questions. Well, she asked Evelyn um, something uh, to which Evelyn answered, you know what, I know who I am now. I'm not the same person that I used to be. You know, I don't let social media get me all revved up. And the one thing that does get at me, though, is you cannot talk about my kids. Okay, my kids are off limits. It was like she was taking jabs at Jackie. She knew that this was going to inflame the issue. She was saying this shit because she knew that Jackie was out there and that Jackie, um, you know, was really trying to uh, not fuck this up for Shawnee. But to me, it was like she was poking at her. And nobody else there, as far as we know anyway, would know what she meant other than the group of girls that have been involved on the show. So she's saying that, and I was just like, well, that's kind of fucked up because you see out there Jackie Chow, she having palpitations, and she looking down, and she doing the cross and all of this. I said, girl, this is a mess. Then um, Tammy. I think that Tammy was bothered by that. I think that as the season has gone on, Tammy has realized that Evelyn is not necessarily her friend that they made up just for the sake of this show. But uh, I think Tammy has been looking out, uh, looking at Evelyn out the side of her eye lately. And really, she probably don't feel it for none of these bitches, okay? Let me get through this damn season, get my money, and keep on moving. But I think that, that what she did bothered her. Because, bitch, game recognized game. And you out here trying to fucking get this girl riled up. And you know she trying not to go there. Then when she start trying to fight your ass, then you going to be saying that she crazy and she wild and she out of control and all of this. So that's when Tammy kind of took up for Jackie. Again, nobody else would know what she was talking about. But she was just like, you know what? And Jackie is a really good person. She um, is supportive. You know, she always tries to help everybody. You tell them what she's doing and she's there. Okay. And whether or not the shit was true or not, I still feel like Tammy did that more to get Evelyn upset than to support Jackie. Everybody was like, you know, so now Tammy and Jackie are best friends? No, I don't think that that's what it is. It was more about getting at Evelyn, and the shit worked, because Evelyn was pissed that she did that. And uh, she said that she's never going to forget that she invited um, 
uh, 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 Jackie to Miami. You don't give a fuck if you never gonna forget something. I always wanting to never somebody. Don't you never say that about me. Don't you never. Everything is she never this and you better never that and you know I never this and so sick of all of it. Later on Malaysia and um, Jackie they go to an Ethiopian restaurant and Jackie tells her about how she was invited to Miami. She says she's not really sure if she wants to go. And Malaysia says you know what they're gonna gang up on you. You're gonna be out there with all of the Miami crew. I'm kind of nervous for you. Jackie says well Tammy did say some really nice things about me at the event you know she took up for me. That kind of made me feel good because I wasn't expecting it. Malaysia was like well I don't even understand what the division is with these group of ladies. I mean why we can't let bygones be bygones well Malaysia. Okay, there wasn't really a problem with you, it was what you did. Don't act like you don't remember what you did. I'm all for letting bygones be bygones because the shit is all stupid. But don't forget what you did. That's all I'm saying. But we all need to be friends. Yes, we all need to be friends. But that's not what Basketball Wives is about. Now, Hazel, she has this damn showcase. Remember, she sings. She says she just gonna have two songs. She says all the girls is invited, even Malaysia. And Malaysia's whole thing is I'm here. You know, these girls, I'm not quite sure if they're gonna talk to me or not. Shawnee says that she can feel Malaysia's stank attitude. I don't think that Malaysia was being stank. I just don't, I don't, I think Malaysia doesn't know how they're gonna be with her. One day it's one way, the next day it's another. So she just probably felt like she needed to keep her distance. I still like Malaysia when uh, a single white female is not around. She's way more likable. So anyway, Shawnee takes a different approach. Okay, um, Malaysia, can I talk to you for a second? Mm-hmm. So they go back to the back, and Shawnee was just like, you know, we're going to go to Miami, and I would like to invite you. I said, and Shawnee just told us that the bitch had a stink attitude, but she's going to invite Malaysia, too. I guess this will be good for Jackie. She'll feel like she got somebody here for her. So Malaysia says, you know what? Yeah, I'll go. Okay, show them how it's done. Like I said, let bygones be bygones. So she goes back and tells Jackie that she was invited. And Jackie is happy now. There's some relief there. You know, now she got, you know, a homegirl there that can kind of help her through this mess that's about to be happening. Then we get Hazel out there. And Josh, she sing her one song. Talk about it's a fucking show. Okay, it is for the basketball. Why? This place is fucking empty. They didn't even take the time to try to fill up the fucking club or room okay lodge whatever the fuck it was okay it was just them had the nerve to go sit up in the very fucking front it's because there's no damn body else back there did i tell you guys that evelyn didn't show up that's why there was no drama and jackie says that they have way more fun when evelyn is not around then fast forward you guys we are in miami okay and everybody is feeling good in one car we have shawnee tammy and we have jennifer and then in the other car we have uh jackie and hazel Jackie is still on this, uh, you know, Evelyn wants to fuck her daughter. And, you know, Hazel is like, girl, she don't want to fuck your daughter. Jackie is really on that page right now. The bitch is crazy, you guys. I'm telling you. So Hazel and Jackie, they get to the hotel. You know, the place is really nice. Malaysia joins them. Okay, she's going to help them turn up, okay, get crunk. And then the doorbell rings, and uh, it is Michael Vick's wife and another friend of theirs. But they sit around and they small talk. I said, Michael Vick's wife, child, you didn't let these damn people talk you into going on this fucking show and offer up your yacht. For these old ghetto ass bitches to get up there and get to fighting and shit. Because that's exactly what it's going to be. But uh, yeah, Michael Vick's wife said, you know what, I got a yacht. I want everybody to come, you know, spend a night on there. We can have a good time. Jackie was just like, oh God, and, and Evelyn going to be there. Jackie concerned that she can't even uh, swim. So she, she might get her ass thrown off the boat. So she's all worried. She's not sure if she thinks she's going to go on this yacht. But child, she's going to go on the yacht. Again, I am so glad next week is the finale. I swear for God, I will not be reviewing this show ever again. <laughs> All right, you guys, let me get off here, get back to work. Make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe to the channel. I'm It's Rocks, the channel's for It's Rocks. Everything else I do will be in the bottom bar. All right? All right, so I hope that you have a wonderful, wonderful rest of your day. I plan on doing the same. Until next time, Rockstars, bye.